Okay. Y'all. So it updated all yesterday evening forever. But this laptop's really slow. And I opened it up today and it's giving me all kinds of trouble. I told y'all I was getting plucked. <laughs> getting pluckered. <laughs> uh, getting upset. Because I thought they got my laptop. And anyway, so Microsoft pops up. And I don't ever sign into Microsoft anywhere. I don't know about that. I'm very basic in everything I do. If you haven't noticed. I don't have all the bells and whistles. I don't want, need all that. I got too much to worry about of what I'm doing and what I'm writing and what I'm learning and what I'm needing to tell y'all to be worrying about it looking pretty. So. Oh, I didn't say hi, hi. I'm sorry, hi. I'm just flustered. I don't think it's right that people who work for FEMA and Red Cross are staying up in five-star hotels, getting fed all their meals, getting per diems, getting huge hourly pay, overtime pay, travel expenses, freaking everything, free education. God. And what have I heard that those entities are doing for the people i haven't heard anything and i've been looking and y'all know i'm looking i tell you every single thing that i look at because i am transparent i need to make record of everything i'm doing because of the writing of the art i'm not just some nobody I will not be ostracized anymore because my duty is to myself, to my kin, to the animals, and to the people who want to come on. So anyway, back to this. So what this, my, it, Microsoft wanted me to sign in. Well, I don't know. I don't have no password or nothing for that. It did say my email address, so I said send a code to my email. So it uh, sent me a code. And then it wanted me to create a password, a pen. It said a pen. In order to sign in to my computer now. I'm no longer just a window screen with my password go in. Now it's going through Microsoft with my pen that I created. And this is the next page that pops up. It's been taking all morning. I don't know what time it is. It wants me to choose privacy settings for my device. Okay, online speak re speech recognition. It wants to listen to you. What you say. No. Find my device. If I lose it, find it. No. No. Inking and typing. Don't use my diagnostic data to help improve the language recognition and suggestion capabilities of apps and services running on Windows. <laughs> no. Advertising ID. The number of ads you you see won't change but they may be less relevant to you no, no location you won't be able to get location based experiences like directions and weather or enjoy other services that require your location to work uh, at this time, no. Diagnostic data. Send only info about your device. Its settings and capabilities and whether it is performing properly. Diagnostic 
data is used to help keep Windows secure and up to date, troubleshoot problems, and make product improvements. I don't need that. No. Tailored experiences. The tips, ads, and recommendations you see will be more generic and may be less relevant to you. Uh, no. Now, some of this may be on my phone, but I'm just going to say no to all this on my computer. You know, this baby don't ever leave. It stays right here. It don't need none of that. All I do is, uh, is hold information in there. I don't go searching around. I do all that on my phone. So we're going to give it all a no and accept. Look, I'm in. Oh, goodness, thank goodness. Okay, I've got some work I want to do. And if anybody has heard anything different or seen anything different than our rescue entity companies staying in a high-end hotel, if you know of anything different, and am I getting wrong information? I mean, I just wish that there was some more transparency about all of this. It just seems too quiet. And when my sister's involved in anything, I don't trust it at all. At all, babe. At all. I've never felt such betrayal. <laughs> I can't even talk about it. All right, love y'all. Six minutes and seven minutes, y'all help me through my crisis. Let's get to work. Or to play, or to just be. Don't buy nothing. Bye.